Hi Cancer, I hope you're doing well. So we'll be looking at whoever you're thinking about here. So their overall stance, Six of Wands in reverse, Queen of Wands upright. You know, this is some confidence issues here uh, coming through in this person's energy. I'm getting in the past, this may have been a bit of a ghosting situation, but definitely this there has been separation in the past and this person seems to be working on themselves. They don't have confidence in this situation. I mean, they don't even have confidence in themselves, right? For their feelings, we have powerless. Let's clarify the Six of Wands in reverse here, where this person stands. They are attracted to you, but they're not taking action towards you. Page of Wands, Knight of Wands in reverse. But they're wanting to, because they have a lot of passion for you. But they don't have confidence in themselves that they can make this work. Nine of Swords. Insecurities is what I'm getting. If this person's done you wrong, there can be guilt. And this person's thinking about um, their strategizing of how to come back towards you with Magician. Why is, Queen of Wands, why is Queen of Wands here for the person on Cancer's mind? Page of Wands, Knight of Wands in reverse again. Ace of Cups wanting to come through. This person has a lot of love for you, Cancer. Bottom deck energy, we have lovers. There's no lack of attraction or love here, but definite insecurities coming through. How they'll be viewing you, we have Page of Wands upright, Three of Cups in reverse. This person sees you as moving on, perhaps putting yourself out there dating. Um, you're very curious. They do find you to be attractive, but they feel you're, they have a fear that you'll find someone better, is what I'm getting. Clarify page of wands for high. Ace of Pentacles, King of Pentacles, and reverse. Some of you may be starting a new job or they see that your um, your passion, your drive is being channeled into some sort of project, financial matters here. But you seem to be very work focused and perhaps um, excited about some financial endeavor. There may be something to celebrate when it comes to your work. Why is Three of Cups here? For how this person will be viewing cancer star yeah six of pentacles you have options is how they're seeing you you're healing some of you this can talk about nightlife right going out for drinks they feel that you're in control here in this situation six of pentacles some of them may have felt breadcrumb that you give very little of yourself to them Especially if it's a newer connection, they're really excited if it's a new energy, but there's a little bit of intimidation when it comes to you. But they're seeing you as someone who's dating. We have strong 11th house and friendship coming through. Some of you, you could have been friends with this person or met through friends. You could have been acquaintances here. But they're putting you on a pedestal. Queen of Wands, the star, someone who's the center of attention. Um, the spotlight is on you here. Cancer is how they're seeing you. And they feel small compared to you. How they're feeling, we have powerless, afraid. Five of Cups in reverse, the tower upright, four of pentacles. Some of you, if it's a newer person, they could be coming out of something. Um, they're healing. They're, have, they're having to let go of something before they can start a fresh slate, right? Because there's something that crumbled here. Others of you, this can talk about a separation between the both of you. It may have been something shocking, sudden that happened, an argument perhaps, right? But why this person is feeling afraid? I'm getting intimidation, but they're holding back. After this period of separation or whatever this tower moment was um they're holding back but they want to come towards you so that is why they're afraid why is four of pentacles here for how this person will be feeling about cancer hangman yeah it's a difficult one for them they feel stuck because yeah we had unsure at the bottom of your mixed emotions right there's two pathways here we have uncertain doubtful not confident exactly what i was getting 
This person doesn't have faith in this situation. Some of you, this person has a harder time um, stepping out of their comfort zone. They have trust issues stemming from a failed relationship. I'm definitely seeing that. They're trying to let go of their control issues here with the hangman, but very few of you, this person could be um, in another situation that they need to release themselves from, but they're scared to take that risk. Nine of Pentacles in reverse. If they're not in another situation, Cancer, this talks about codependency when it comes to you, right? And this person seems to be uh, very self-aware here. If I look at this spread as a whole, so they're aware if they have any codependency issues, they know, which is what they're trying to release themselves from with the hangman, right? Their intentions, we have eight of swords, 10 of wands. Yeah, their intentions is to release themselves from this anxiety, um, to work on any of these insecurities. Clarify eight of swords in reverse. Yeah, they're trying to cut through any illusions here. Ace of Swords. Some of you, this person has been avoiding you. Seven of Swords, Five of Cups. This can also be an energy that doesn't face their emotions. Um, they may divert their attention to finances or putting themselves out, out there, getting attention from others, validation, right? And they don't deal with the issue at hand. Full Wheel of Fortune. Why is Eight of Swords in reverse here? Yeah, this indecision is causing this person stress that they don't want to deal with. They feel they have to pick a direction, right? But definitely I'm seeing someone who has a lot on their plate and they're saying I can't give this situation attention right now because I have so much going on here in terms of work and finances, home, work life, right? That is what I'm getting here. And they're wanting to drop this situation. That is the conclusion they've come to. Why is Ten of Wands in reverse here? Sun, yeah, they're healing after a fallout, two of cups. Some of you, there was a disconnect because of the differences between the both of you in the past, right? Some of you, the distance was too much. Others of you, it can be age difference, cultural race, or just your beliefs, right? You weren't seeing eye to eye. But this person has that clarity which they didn't have in the past with unsure. And that clarity is that they don't, they want to drop this situation for the time being. Yeah, they're saying we don't see eye to eye. Some of you because of a third energy. Third energy can be their work, finances, but they're not putting in the work for the time being. Their actions, now this is where it's uh, contradicting their intentions. So their intentions is to hold back and not give to the situation, release themselves. But they're having a hard time because they have feelings for you. So their action is they want to send you a message some of them are scared of your reaction here because you're coming through as the King of Swords. This person feels small in comparison to you, but they're also restless because of this separation. They're hurt and they're missing you. Some of you, there is, you know, physical, but it can be emotional distance. So a part of them is saying, go for it. Send Cancer that message. If they need to apologize, apologize, right? With the Page of Cups, but then there's intimidation with the Fool in reverse. You know, I shouldn't take that risk. I have so much to lose, especially if they're in another commitment, right? If they're committed to you, 
I don't think they want the separation cancer. They're not wanting to deal with the responsibilities, but they're still emotionally clinging on to you. It's a weird situation. I want one more for the fool in reverse. Yeah, they can't let go of you. You represent wish fulfillment. I think I got this for your reading for the monthly as well. Yeah, you represent wish fulfillment to this person. You are the one they want to be with because they're unable to let you go. Four of Pentacles, Page of Cups, Eight of Cups in reverse. Their intentions was they wanted to let go. But it's easier said than done, right? So this person does watch you. Page of Swords Fool, they want to take that leap towards you. They're curious to know where the situation can go. And there's unfinished business here, world in reverse. They feel it's not over. How you'll be feeling about them, Cancer, we have Six of Swords, King of Swords. You're detached here. Some of you may be open to communication, others of you, no. You, you've said what you needed to, because the King is pointing his sword down, right? And he's saying, look, I've said what I needed to, and I'm not budging, which is why Emperor was coming through with the devil, right? Control issues for how this person was seeing you. Let's clarify Six of Swords. In some of you, there is distance. You may be traveling. I see that in your outcome. Why is Six of Swords here? But you're not wanting drama. If there was conflict, right? You're not wanting that. You're wanting peace of mind. Which is why you may have established stronger boundaries, right? Uh, this is what I will and will not tolerate. Yeah, some of you are saying it's over. But there's still a sense of... This situation caused you to feel restless. Four of Swords. You felt you lost your peace of mind, right? Which is why you're saying, you know, if this is going to cost me my peace of mind, it's not worth it. You're choosing your mind here. Mind over heart. Clarify King of Swords. You're giving very little to this person and that is how they were viewing you as well. Especially in the past, if you were generous with this person, you're pulling back here. You're healing. Three of Swords in reverse. Why is King of Swords here for Cancer's feelings? Devil, yeah. You're holding back because of someone's reckless ways. Someone was immature. They were leaping into situations without looking. They were careless, right? Gambling with your heart, some of you. Third party situation, playing the field. You're saying this is toxic and I don't want to be a part of a third party situation or whatever your toxic ways are, right? Which is why you're being very firm here. Your outcome, we have seven of swords in reverse, ace of cups, three of pentacles in reverse, eight of wands, chariot. Some of you may be traveling back home with the eight of wands and chariot or communicating with family members, your mother, that is coming through here. But I see a lot of excitement within the home and a lot of movement. So if things have been a bit stuck or slow, expect forward movement here. Seven of Swords in reverse is when we're coming to reality about a situation. You do care about this person. Right here, you were trying to detach in your outcome. You're saying, you know what? I do care about this person. I do have feelings for them, right? But regardless, I'm not being a part of a one-sided situation or where this person's not putting in equal effort, right? Which is why Three of Pentacles in reverse. You know, I care about you, but I'm not going out of my way to make anything work. Some of you may be making plans to travel. If this is a new love, Ace of Cups, Eight of Wands, Chariot, there may be distance here. And there may be some delays, which is why the three is in reverse, right? You can't come together. That'll be for a few of you. Another scenario I was getting, Cancer, it is a general reading. This person was seeing you as someone who may be dating, uh, putting yourself out there. Whether that's correct or not, you would know that is how they were perceiving you, right? Someone who's going out and about with family, friends, celebrating nightlife. That is the vibe. 
Um, you may be, if you are dating, this may be back and forth text messages. There may be a new love here with the Ace of Cups, someone you have a lot of physical attraction with. So you may have a choice here because on Chariot, we have this way or that way, right? So you'll have to choose. So it really depends on what you're manifesting here moving forward. Cancer, this person's outcome, we have High Priestess, Seven of Wands in reverse, King of Cups, Wheel of Fortune, Devil in reverse. This person feels they have little to no control over this situation, but what they do have, what they do, they're very uncertain in their outcome, but what they do know is that they have love for you. It's unconditional, right? King of Cups is when we have stable emotions, right? It's not, you know, one day you love a person, another day you hate. You're saying, you know what? I love this person. I care about cancer. So that is where they're at. But something about this situation, they feel they don't have all the facts, right? They don't have that clarity, which is why they're not exerting effort or fighting for this situation. Some of you, they're saying, I don't know where I stand with you, right? But we also have Wheel of Fortune, Devil in Reverse. It's almost a karmic connection, or this is how this person feels. That, you know, right person, wrong time, star-crossed lovers. But there may be something toxic about this situation, which is why it's not moving for forward. Or this person has some healing to do if they do have some toxic ways, a drinking problem, drugs. Are they in another connection, right? That is why the Wheel of Fortune is in reverse. But they are learning some lessons through you here. And others of you, it's a new connection. There's distance. Um, this is outside influences here with the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. Okay, Cancer, let's get you some Oracle cards. Oops. <laughs> we have, when you smile at me, I feel like I can do anything. Wow, this person really enjoys your company. We have, I like a sense of humor. We have smile and I like a sense of humor. This person really enjoys your sense of humor. You make them feel lighthearted, like you've lifted a weight off of their shoulders when they're with you. That is what they're saying. And they may literally like your smile. That is something they're attracted to. Let's get one more. Okay, let's take those because they did fall out together. We have my family may not approve of you. I like things the way they are. Okay, so what I'm seeing here is that fool in reverse, you know, that third party can be their family if they're not committed, right? Not everyone will be in a third party situation. So it may be interference. And there was some differences here with temperance. So that is something they're thinking about. You know, I want to come towards cancer, but are we the right fit? Are we compatible, right? This person's very traditional, uh, contrary to how they appear, because I'm getting a very fun-loving energy, someone who's very innocent, childlike, right? They can be, but they are deep down very traditional and likely not to stray from whatever their upbringing was, right? Which is why, fool in reverse, I'm not familiar. I'm not leaping into unfamiliar territory. They may have a hard time stepping out of their comfort zone is what I'm getting. Fool in reverse and four of pentacles. And as a result, they miss um, opportunities because there's no lack of love here. We have lovers, king of cups, right? I draft notes to you that I don't send. Yeah, I see this in their actions. Page of cups. I want to send that message, fool in reverse, I can't take that risk. I'm, af I'm afraid, and we had afraid in, in their feelings, yeah. Definitely see that. Old wounds, this is for those of you, I mean it can be for all of you, right? There may be something from their past that is holding them back from taking a leap with you, right? Because they feel they haven't healed from their past heartbreak. Uh, Tower, Five of Cups in Reverse. They are healing, but they're still influenced by what happened in their past. 
So they may be rejecting your love here or just not trusting, right? You know, been there, done that. I don't want to go down that path again. But they're tempted. We have adventure. Yeah, definitely reminds me of travel here. So they do, yeah, they find you to be a lot of fun. And we have lust and love here. And also trap, yeah. There is lust here for sure. I was seeing that in their overall stance. Strong physical attraction. Some of you may be with adventure and the travel I was seeing in your outcome. Can be that you're traveling to see this person. And we have joy, yeah, adventure and joy. But this person's scared with a never enough and disillusionment that once you get to know the real them, you won't be as interested. That they're not enough. I was picking up on confidence issues here. For advice, Cancer, we have ownership. I take ownership for how I make others feel and I do my part to repair any bridges I might have burned or perhaps even lightly sing singed. If bridge mending feels impossible, then I can start small. Instead of becoming a bridge architect, maybe I'll just skip the bridge and walk the long way around. Taking ownership is great for burning calories. Oh, so we have answer the call. When they call, answer the call. Don't let pride keep your love broken when your heart wants to fix it. They might be worth a second chance. Gift. You may be surprised by someone's act of kindness. Be open to small gestures or any proposals that come your way. Embrace the gift. I'll leave that to your interpretation. Answer the call. Chariot, you have a decision to make. Should I go left or should I go right? So that's free will at play here, Cancer. Will they be worth another chance? That is up to you to decide. But yes, Cancer, that is what I have for you. Take care of yourself and I'll see you next week. Bye.